We're excited today because we're showing the world's first 32 nanometer based microprocessors. And the first demonstration I want to show you is the Arendelle processor, 32 nanometer technology, running in a notebook form factor. So this is a prototype notebook with the new 32 nanometer processor in it built into this form factor and you can see it running. Uh, today we just happen to be showing uh, Vista and uh, we're showing a number of different applications open. We're showing media playback and here you can see on the, the uh, performance monitor that we have a machine that is capable of supporting four threads. So it's a two-core, four-thread machine with integrated graphics, and it fits nicely within uh, the existing notebook form factor and will deliver higher performance and good flexibility between uh, single-threaded performance with the Turbo Boost technology and multi-threaded performance with the uh, four-thread you know, two, core per, two cores and two threads per core hyperthreading. Uh, here we have uh, a demonstration of desktop motherboards. This is today's motherboard with the Intel 4 series chipset, just showing that we have a three chip partition with the processor, the uh, north bridge, and the south bridge. Uh, being the, the backbone of this um, desktop motherboard. Looking forward to the repartition platform, here you see a simplified motherboard with the processor that has the integrated memory controller uh, and the integrated graphics, and then only one other uh, uh, large-scale chip here. This is the uh, 5 series chipset. So it simplifies the design and layout of a motherboard and uh, will we'll deliver additional performance uh, also. Here for our desktop demonstration, we've been comparing today's uh, 45 nanometer Core 2 Penryn based design to the future um, desktop technology with Clarkdale and the 5 series chipset. And uh, what we see is that when we're doing a 3D render, uh, the render completes more quickly on the new platform compared to today's platform because, uh, again, we have a, a, a Nehalem-based compute core and we have uh, four threads of compute uh, with this new platform. We're also showing that we can run a uh, current 3D game with the integrated graphics that we have on 45 nanometer technology. So we have a fairly robust operation already on this uh, early sample of the processor uh, looking at the 45 nanometer integrated graphics.